Is it still a good idea to start flipping houses in 2022? Find out, coming up next. In real estate, it's always about maximizing your return on your investment. The whole point about flipping properties is to remodel, repair, and sell for a profit. The average house flip bagged investors 73,000 in profit. Those are some pretty impressive numbers. Is that enough to get you started today? I made this channel for you, the new and experienced investor. Do you wanna live the life you've always wanted through real estate? Then you're in the right place. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share this video with anyone that you know that's interested in investing. To achieve maximum ROI, you need to be good at it. You need to know how to scout properties, how to identify value in properties, and how to remodel and repair for the most inexpensive way possible. All in all, you can make some decent returns with house flipping. If you're good at it, you can make some seriously impressive numbers. But is it still a good idea to start this year? Let's look at some pros and cons. Number one, ability to make decent returns. There's still that ability out there. Flipping is a numbers game. Make sure that you know your numbers going in and coming out. Yes, you can still flip in 2022. I encourage you to do that, but I would encourage you to also keep an eye on those numbers. The purchase price, rehab costs, after repair value. That's the key. Number two, it actually can be a part-time thing. It, it can be something that you work after hours, on the weekends. Uh, it's your project. You have a contractor working. You're gonna need to go by at least once a week. That can be on the weekends, um, after your nine to five job, whatever it is. It can be uh, something that you can handle on a part-time basis. Number three, it can be an absolutely rewarding job. It is so much fun to go out and take a look at these projects and see what the possibility is at the end of the day. And that just, for me, that is, is fun in itself. And then once you get it under contract, then you start the rehab and you see the final product, it gives you such a sense of pride. It can be very rewarding. There are some cons. Not every house may sell for what you want, especially right now, especially as you're starting to see interest rates rise. That's why I see you need to be careful. You need to look at your numbers. Maybe if you're buying at 70 cents on the dollar, maybe you start going down to 65 cents, 60 cents on the dollar. You need to be careful. Number two con can be difficult to start. It's not like it's easy to get into a project that uh, you're gonna buy for a million dollars. If you're doing hard money, you're gonna need at least 20% down. If you have $200,000 sitting around in a bank and you wanna start a project like this, awesome. But sometimes it's a little difficult to get into this game. If you do it right and do the research with every property that you purchase, then house flipping can indeed be a wise form of investment. There is always money in real estate. The fact that prices are going up only works in your favor. But don't think that every property will be worth flipping. Make sure that you do your due diligence and seek advice whenever possible. If you love flipping videos, then click on this flipping video right here. I helped one of my students flip a mobile home out in Hemet. You won't believe how this one turned out. And you don't have to get started by yourself. Reach out to me and I'll help you in any way that I can. See you on the next one.